Police in Taipei have one of the toughest assignments in the nation. Besides the day-to-day -day duties of being an officer, they have to deal with the many protests that happen in the capital city. To retain police on the Taipei Force, last year, the Ministry of the Interior approved extra pay for officers in the city as part of a pilot program. Now the program will end, leading some to question whether the ministry's motives are related to the ascension of independent Taipei Mayor Ke Wenzhe. Review of our one-year pilot program clearly showed severe disruption to the overall police pay system. Starting from this year, 2015, the Ministry of the Interior will cease its pilot program of giving extra pay for burdensome work. Last year, many police in the capital requested a transfer around the time of the Sunflower Movement protests. In May, a month after the protests ended, the Ministry of the Interior approved additional pay of 3,000 to 8,000 NT per month for officers in Taipei. Just one week after Taipei Mayor Ke Wenzhe took office, the added pay was canceled. The funds were budgeted by Taipei City. It's strange that I want to give money to the police, but the Ministry of the Interior is opposed. I don't understand the reasoning. Is this a way of flexing its muscles to Ke Wenzhe? If the central government wants to play political games like this, Rather than putting the people first, the people will know. While some DPP city councillors believe the central government cut the additional pay to show up Ke, KMT city councillor Li Feng Chong Wu gave a different view. Li said many officers privately expressed displeasure toward the policy, calling it a blow to morale.